And welcome back to some more Dying Light. Uh, right, well, I have opened the floodgates right now. Yeah, the beast is coming. Ooh, fancy. Upcoming standalone zombie adventure that follows the story of Kyle Crane years after the event of Dying Light. The following. Ah, the following. Yeah, that was the DLC. Stack back into the shoes of the legendary hero. Explore a tightly crafted open world tightly crafted open world and save the inhabitants of the valley. Right, and also there's some armored zombies, uh, American American football, touchdown. What is this then? No idea. Something weird here. And also this. Hmm. Well, who knows, but we're just gonna press continue. Uh, wit event. Probably a new event. Oh yeah, but I've opened up the floodgates of this game now. Oh, it is so pretty and it's so fun to just run around. No, 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 no. To, to be fair, I'm like, I still uh, plan to mostly play in Shrouded and explore around when I'm talking about random stuff. But I do want to kind of think and talk about what my ideal zombie game would be. Because this is fairly close to what I want. I do enjoy the idea of first person, especially when it comes to like parkour stuff. That would definitely be something. Now, I also spent the past four hours, uh, I'm not joking, four hours on the dot in order to try to get my daughter to sleep. Now, she's like, like she's not being, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to complain. This is the best time of my life and I do know it. Hang on, we here we have a little thiefy boy. No, stand still, you. Why aren't you standing still? Uh, what are you doing? <laughs> yes. Uh, bandit caught. Whoop. Yeah, I'm not trying to complain. But oh boy, she's a tough one. Didn't cry. I mean, she is not even winching. She's just incredibly awake. Uh, which sometimes is fine too. Uh, let's see. I do need some more honey. I mean, I'm, I don't, have I been here recently? Okay. Well, there's a storm going on. So I guess we will just run around and explore for a bit. I mean, I've been to every nook and cranny of this game, I think at least, but still they add new stuff all the time. But yeah, just running around without the HUD and just looking at the environment, I mean, well, looking outside my window right now and this, I mean, it looks basically the same. <laughs> I mean, I don't live in the city. Oh, hang on. Oh, more legendary stuff. Now, hang on a moment. Let's see. Ballista. Why don't I have... I don't have arrows? Hang on, what's the crafting thing? No, that's C. N? No, J? Maybe? No, that's journal. Uh, crafting. Can I make fire arrows? I have regular arrows. Infected arrow. Okay, I can also make shurikens. But I can just make regular arrows? Huh. Why? Ammunition? I can't make ballista. Okay. No, no, no. Hang on a moment. Uh, let's see. Then can't I trade this off with this? Oh boy, is that a lot of damage. That's a lot of a lot of damage. Yeah, but I guess I need this then. Okay, now I have these things. Oh yeah, I can also charge them. Oh, a little biscuit. And a headshot. And another headshot. Come on then. Stand still, you. Oh, is that a big fella? Yeah, I took away his mask. Okay, stuff exploded. And that's not the uh, best. Okay, that turns zombies into super zombies. He's gonna probably get turned into a zombie soon, since he's standing in the things. Oh, bandit escaped, but I'm probably uh, gonna end up... Ooh, I leveled up, not bad. And yeah, gonna end up getting surrounded. Ow. Right, oh, okay, am I safe? Um, take care of this little bastard. Okay, no fast ones coming. Oh, hang on, that's a, that's a boy. Okay, is he a zombie? I think he's a zombie. Oh, okay, okay, calm down. Okay. <laughs> uh, what about now? Any moment now. Oh, hang on. I found a sweet spot. A little bit like a so, a little bit like a so, and like a dad, yes. What do we have here then? Surgeon apron and a sandstorm kit. Yeah, I already have that. But, uh, sure. I mean, I'm looking for artifacts, weapons, just to complete my uh, ensemble. Okay, was I making a point? What was the latest point that I wanted to make? I don't remember. Well, my daughter is asleep now. She's sleeping tight. Hopefully she will be asleep for a couple of hours. Most likely just two. Uh, hopefully more than one. And I like a show. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, just running around this game is so much fun. Yeah, that's the fire I was talking about in yesterday's video. Whoopsie daisy. 
yeah, my I ideal zombie game. Now, it got recommended to me by, uh, oh, I should really look it up, uh, Kentsu, I believe. I've been a commenter on my videos for quite some time. I, again, I remember the blue, uh, the blue account banner, account, no, oh, oh, the profile picture, and that was the name, yeah. I remember that, but, yeah, name series are horrible here. Yeah, they recommended days gone basically where you have a mortal a motorcycle and you drive around or ride around and kill zombies now that game was also highly anticipated mainly because of the horde mechanic there was like supposed to be a ton of zombies that you could fight at the same time now it was a little bit broken at the start but i think i got the game for free i don't remember how i have it on playstation 4 i don't remember if i finished it uh, it's been so long, and also I don't have a capture card, so yeah, not gonna be able to rec oh, oh, record that unless I do it the old-fashioned style with just having a camera pointed at the television. Oh, uh, I remember people used to <laughs> record gameplay like that. Oh, that was indeed something. But yeah, my ideal zombie game. No, I do enjoy parkour. That is something that I've always enjoyed, especially after like the Assassin's Creed games and also Mirror's Edge back in the PlayStation 3 era. And of course, in the PlayStation 2, it was, uh, you know, Shadow of the Colossus climbing and stuff like that. Oh, wait, it's, it's so much fun. So fun, in fact, that of course, I, I think uh, a lot of people have tried it. But yeah, I did dabble a little bit into parkour and a jump and a roll. Yeah, I perfected the role, at least when I was younger. If I do that now, I'll probably die. Uh, but yeah, so definitely there would have to be some sort of parkour and climbing mechanics in my ideal zombie game. Now, I do whoop, I do enjoy being able to hit the zombie just once and them dying. Because that is a problem that I have with a lot of zombie games, that they're like bullet sponges. Like, sometimes it makes sense because they're, you know, zombies, but if I hit a zombie over the head. Is this a zombie? No, that's a feller. I'm not gonna antagonize him. Let's see, zombies? Yeah, okay, so if I hit a zombie like a show, I cut off his arm. Like, I do enjoy just one-shotting them, but sometimes it's good to have a couple of shots if your weapon is dull or starting to get broken. And I, like, there should be some durability when it comes to weapons, but again, weapon durability is a uh, tiny bit annoying. Hang on. Kite? Oh yeah, I yeah, mean, because that's the church. But I would like a little bit more free roaming. Like, obviously it should be open world, but I think it should be more open world than what this game is. Because as fun as it is to run around and jump in these cities, I kind of want to, like, just travel to another city. Equally as big. I'm asking for a lot over here, but yeah. I mean, there was this game, it turned out to be a massive flop, it was just, you know, stolen assets over and over, I should look up the game, but, yeah, I mean, it was supposed to be big survival multiplayer RPG, but it just belly flopped, and, yeah, I think it was actually removed, and people, or, like, the developers complained about, uh, everyone complaining about the game, because it was, you know, broken, incredibly broken, but it was a good premise. Yeah, to be able to just travel outside of the city and then travel to another city, like travel to those mountains over there, preferably by car. And I also did enjoy the car mechanic of Dying Light uh, 1, the, was it called The Following? Yeah, I believe it was called The Following, the DLC where you had a car. Now you had to be careful that the car didn't break and of course you had to manage gas. Now at some point, I mean, you, the, the, the gas just becomes infinite because you're stuck up. Now, I want something a little bit realistic, probably. Like, you have to carry the cans, or you have to store the cans in the car. I mean, that's what I did uh, in the DLC. But yeah, it wasn't really an issue to not have gasoline. No, oh, yeah. Now, I also did enjoy the mechanic. Now, I don't remember how much I actually explored the horde mechanic of Days Gone. Like, I, I can't really remember. Now, that could be because of multiple reasons. Maybe I didn't enjoy the game, or maybe I didn't even finish it. Of course, there's a chance that I got the game while I got, you know, a girlfriend that is now my wife. So, we mostly played stuff together, I think. I, I like, again, I'm not sure. But yeah, massive hordes of zombies. Like, they have increased the zombies that are over here. Like, right here, we have a... 
infected zombie. Let's see, can I do a little bit like a show ish? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, if it's going to be parkour on this level, I want the, like there should be a billion zombies here. Again, asking for a lot would require quite a hefty computer. And when it comes to graphics, I mean, I kind of want it on the same level as Dying Light. Then again, visual fidelity is not the same as realism, so they could do something else, make it maybe a little bit more fantastical. And in order to make it a little bit more PG, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't need to be as gory as this game, as much as I enjoy decapitating zombies and all that kind of good stuff, like going around with a shotgun and just kaboom. Uh, okay, whoop. Uh, this isn't gonna end well. Oh, of course, I do enjoy the crafting mechanic of this game. But again, you're not reliant on it. I mean, as long as you have just a melee weapon, you're you're good to go. But yeah, would like some, uh, like, crossbows and arrow action. That would be very good. Okay, it's starting to get dark, and that is when stuff gets dangerous. Actually, let's... I can teleport around, can't I? I know that I have a quest over here, but I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, let's travel over here. Oh yeah, and I did get a haircut. Uh, um, uh, my wife cut my hair yesterday, which is awesome because I really needed a haircut. The problem with getting old is that, well, sometimes your hair thins and, you know, receding hairlines and such, but the hair around my head is incredibly thick which means it gets warm, and I do not like being warm. <sighs> I prefer a cold breeze. Okay, now we're in the big city. Ooh, boy. Up, 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 and then we fly. And a little bit over here, maybe. Actually, we can activate the flashlight. Up, up, okay, coming up. Ooh, okay, that was kind of a close one. Hmm. Let's see, I need to gain some altitude. Where can I do that? Ah, over here I can. Right, okay, so if we aim a little bit up and aim up again, double fire, uh, okay, and another one, and like so, and jump over here. <laughs> uh, oh boy, is this game fun. Green, yes. What is this? All oh, right, it's one of the, like, guarding people. I've already forgotten been some time since I played this game. Whoop, and we fly. Yeah, I've stated in the whoop. Uh, in the previous video, I'm not too much of a fan of the paraglider. I mean, there should be stuff like this around. I mean, in the other game, you had the grappling hook that, you know, fight physics. Chase started. What? Something chasing me? Oh, oh, yeah. biscuit. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Harper? Agent rank up? Oh, okay, okay. Calm down. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm, let's see, I did need some small infect. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Huh? Yeah, I hear something. Whoop, let's see. Um, was that a guy? I, well, he's dead now. Am I still being chased? Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, this is a good way to just farm the trophies. Oh, you little biscuit. <laughs> okay, I think I'm a little bit too out overpowered because I just, you know, a little bit of a slice and everything is <laughs> in half. Shwoop, yeah. I mean, it doesn't have to be this powerful, but I mean, it is uh, it is fun. Okay, it's starting to get a little bit crowded up in here. And shwoop, great way to level up too. Don't have to really pay much attention. Just a little bit of a left click from time to time. Oh, here's a big boy. Hey, and now he's headless. And a kick. Yeah, 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 come on. I mean, I think that they made the game a little bit more dangerous. I'm not sure. I mean, when I too hit this little bastard, and I mean, it's not the most dangerous thing in the world. Come on, okay. And we take you. Any more? Okay, nothing. Uh, right, well, we might as well go over here. Because this is a safe area. Double jump. And I think maybe I'll be able to sleep here. Maybe. Okay, what do you have to sell us? A hook stick. Hmm. Don't remember those. Let's see, I can sell stuff. I don't think I have any other valuables. Hmm. Stamina cost well uh, and resistance. Yeah, I'm just gonna sell this. Uh, sell that. I guess I'll keep that. What is this? Small box present. Hmm. Yeah, who knows? Do I have a bed over here? I don't. Oh, and also I am infected. Yeah, I need to remember. I need to stay under the UV light. Uh, excuse me. Oh, 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 okay, that was a close one. <laughs> yeah, we can't do nothing. Right, okay, chase end. That's good. Uh, let's see, did I also level up? Okay, what am I leveling up with? Use damage with all two-handed slash. 
Weapons, sniper, firearms, say what name? Hmm. Let's see, blunt weapons, yeah, I can't level up this any further. Not this one either. Do I want this? Didn't I have Joker increases damage of all the throwables? Engineering, explosives, master, immortal. Heal on damage dealt to enemies with melee attack. Oh, legend level 250. Okay, so they've added some weird stuff over here. Pilgrim, yeah, I've leveled up everything here, I think. Now, yeah, I still miss something here, but that's because of uh, bugs and such. Uh, let's see. Couldn't I increase my stamina over here? Uh, let's see. Brawler, I guess. I mean, I don't really. Two handed slash weapon. Ah, uh, why not? Uh, let's see if we get anything special from the loot boxes. Uh, just a single touch and mutation samples. 300. Sure thing. Right. Uh, where are we going? I see some lights over here. I think that's maybe a bed over here. Maybe? Let's see, I can use my spidey senses. Let's see. Okay, where are we? Can I sleep here? No, can I bunk with you? No, apparently you... Let's see. Don't I have a bed? Should have a bed over here. Oh, well, it's further this way. Ah, it's inside here. Yeah, okay, I remember. Okay, let's sleep through the night. Nighttime bonus. Oh boy, okay, do you have anything awesome to sell me? Uh, no, not really. Usually I buy up all of the resources. Let's see, do we have an engineer around? I don't think we have one here. I mean, I'm just gonna jump around anyhow. Uh, let's see, might as well just land right over here and do some parkouring. Yeah. And a tiny jump. What is stopping me? Something weird. Up, okay, there. I guess we'll jump over here. And then a little bit of um, giant jump over here. Let's see, there's a parkour challenge up there, but yeah, I'm just gonna run around for a bit. Oh yeah, I want more of this. More of this indeed. And it does look like, according to the trailer at least, that there's gonna be the same amount of parkour, but more guns. Which is fine, as long as I can, you know, aim with uh, the right, uh, right mouse button rather than control, because that was strange. Oop, and a hop. Three aberration night activity. Uh, so what? Hang on. There's a big boy over here. Huh? Might as well have a look-see. Okay. And a schlep, and a schlep, and a schlep. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think that I'm supposed to be around here at this level. Up oh, and a jump, and a jump. Ooh, legendary people. Yeah, I don't mind if I do. Oh, hang on, what was he doing? Uh, well, we're just gonna jump over here, roll around, jump, and okay. Aha! Come on there. Ow. Oh, okay, okay. Come on. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, H. Oh, oh, ow. Oh, you're right. You are dead. Killed in action. <laughs> uh, let's see. Call for help? No, not call for help. Survivor respawn, maybe. If I call for help, that's multiplayer. Okay. Have they fixed this? Or is this still silent and weird? Eh. I, if, I'd, if I'd used my arrows and, uh, you know, a little bit of healing... I would have done great, but no, I wanted to be fancy and just, oh, I'll ah, do it without any help. Yeah, push. <laughs> right, uh, let's activate the Vice Katana. Flash, whoop, I missed. And whoosh. Oh, he's flying about. <laughs> he's gonna explode. And whoosh. <laughs> Explosions. Yeah, I do like that. Now there's still the game of the Black Myth Wukong that I kind of want to try, but again, I need time. And the thing is, if I start playing that, I'm just gonna get too invested. And it's gonna be a pain for my wife. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I think it's better for me to play games like these, at least for now. So that I can just stop at any time. I mean, I could do that with any game. It's just me being weird. Ooh, when we're flying, and we're flying. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's see, do I have it equipped? No, I don't have it equipped even. Oh yeah, it's in. Okay. Auric, uh thing for my weapon is just floating around. A little bit strange, but uh, sure. Alright, there we go. A little bit more silence. Uh, my neighbors were talking a little bit uh, loudly. I mean, it's a, it's a free country, so I'm not uh, saying anything about that. But yeah, I thought it was my, my daughter that was waking up. Okay, where were we? I mean, the entire idea of this video is just me running around and uh, dreaming of the perfect zombie game. Now, there should also be, like, hunting in the game, I think. 
Now, when it comes to hunting games, I played uh, Hunter Call of the Wilds, which is extremely realistic, but I would rather like something in the lines of Red Dead Redemption, because the hunting in that game is just awesome. It would be very fun to, you know, hunt for little bunny rabbits and such. Yeah, because I think that survival should really be a key. In this game, you don't need to eat. Well, you can't eat and you can't drink, which is which is fine. I mean, it's not necessarily a survival game. It's more, you know, action, running around and parkour, and it should also be optional. Now, it would be, would be very fun if it was like an open RPG, an open world MMO type thing, like that one game tried to be. I don't remember the name of it anymore. I mean, it's just fallen from memory since it was a massive fail a failure. Which is too bad, because it could have been something great. But sadly, it was not. Yeah, okay, let's gain some altitude. I believe it's E. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. <laughs> right, have I done this? Yeah, okay, I've gotten gold. I mean, I... Uh, 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 cancel? There we go. Yeah, I've done most of those things. Oh, there's the fish eye. Yeah, there was something that I needed to do with that feller. I think? Was it the Wanderer? Outpost, pilgrims, something? Yeah, yeah I mean, also in the big city you do need the paraglider in order to traverse. I wish that you didn't, uh, but yeah. Okay, and here also you need a grappling hook. Uh, let's see. Oh, I mean, I could enable... No, where's the grappling hook, I wonder? Was it over here? No? There we go, grappling hook. Yeah, and then, let's see. This thing? There we go. Okay, yeah. Now let's see if I remember how to use this, because... Oh! And a look, and a look goes out, and a look goes out, and a look goes out. Uh -huh. Yeah, because this thing you could just swing around like Spider-Man. Let's see, are we going the right way, or have I gone... No, hang on, we're already here. Say, uh, okay, that was a little bit fast. Uh, right, let's see. Uh, you feather grenades, yeah, that's not, nothing new. I believe that I have all of these, maybe. Slaughter? Huh, interesting. Let's see, upgrade. Ah, now I can upgrade it. Neato. There we go. And yeah, those are all the things. Craft weapons, nothing here. I can repair. I can also exchange this for levels if I want to level further. Not sure if that's something I want to do. I mean, I have all of them, but uh, let's see. Okay, I was supposed to talk to maybe... Hang on. What's this then? Use. Work needed. Hardware store run. Level 9. Side quest. I get electrical mine and vendor chest. Okay, that's very interesting. Uh, let's see, medicine, vendor chest. Oh, yeah, hang on. Uh, molotovs and such. Oh, yeah, they did have this in the original game. That's it. Someone is talking in the background. Right. But I think that I needed to talk to this fellow. Maybe. Hang on, something is going on over here. Who are you? Hello? Let's see. But do I get guns? I'm not sure what exactly what I did. Uh, good luck, something, something. Okay, so I can get some guns. That is good, but uh, let's see. This is my stash. If I track this, trade right from the bandits. Hmm. Well, we're gonna do a little bit of that, maybe. And then maybe we can get some guns. Okay, but where are we supposed to go? Over this way. I also have a question mark over here. Unknown location. Oop. Okay, then. Okay, then, Aiden. Not even sure if I finished my train of thought, if I've already described my perfect zombie game, but uh, yeah, playing without the HUD is a little bit disorienting. Yeah, I mean, I can turn off the flashlight. Something going on over there, but uh, let's see, I have a feeling, is it this way? Am I going the right way? No idea. I'm getting closer. Can I get up over here? Now, the bandits, where are they? Okay, still a little bit further forward. What the... are we getting close? Ah, oh, here we go. Here we have something. Probably bandits. Oh, it's down there. Right, okay. Well, let's have a... look-see. I wonder if this is safe during the night. Probably full of nightmares and whatnot. Uh, hello? On the side? Yeah, there we go. Okay, but most likely there's j just gonna be bandits around. Okay, here we go. I could probably do this stealthily, but I have a feeling that I can just, you know, waltz in and then just kill everyone. Yeah, 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 shut your face, yeah, shut your face, and away with your head, yeah, lower level, you bastards, come on then, oh, you little pissy, <laughs> okay, here we have something, uh, let's see, I can probably just force this open, right, here we go, attack, can I do this attack, okay, yeah, I guess I need to, yeah, 
travel back. Most armory, record a code from GRE quarantine zone. Uh, I guess I'll have to wait until night. Uh, it's gonna be interesting, but again, I don't think I need to do this while uh, recording. There's still a lot of stuff that I could do in this game, but uh, yeah. I mean, I do prefer just running around. Oh, boy, okay, 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 I'm flying over here. Yeah, they've done something to those things. <laughs> uh, right. Oh, hang on. I, I, I thought I would land, but uh, sure. And a little bit of a roll. I've already been playing for uh, over an hour now. I think it's about time that I call it and do some more grown-up stuff, because I do need... I mean, I'll put on a few batches of laundry, but there's still some cleaning that needs to be done while my daughter is asleep and I have time. Oh, but yeah, uh, 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 it's gonna be fun. Oh boy, it's gonna be fun. No, there's also another game that I'm looking forward to. Kinda. I mean, it's uh, with a little bit bad taste, but... Ooh, Crimson Desert. That is definitely gonna be something. I mean... They're the same people who made Black Desert Online, and I dedicated a big portion of my life to that game. Is that a, is that a balloon? What is this? Eh, it just looks interesting. Uh, it's probably one of those uh, Asian candle floaty thingamajigs. Oh, zombies. And dead zombies. <laughs> uh, yeah, this game is fun. Very fun. So I'm probably, I mean, I need to get back to Enshrouded, uh, still a lot of stuff that I want to do, but yeah. I'm just seeing the trailer of uh, The Beast is uh, was enough for me to get back into this. Oh, and just running and climbing and jumping and oh, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And then we fly. Uh -huh. And then we land. Oh yeah, yes indeed. But anyhow, I think that I'm gonna say, as always, until next time.